Alright, well I am actually hoping this is working. So here we are on Galthrey Competitive Oz. And if I am talking to myself, I am feeling like an idiot right now. But we have Disasterology versus Team Equinox. Disasterology being 7th, Equinox being 10th. I think it will be a pretty close game. I think these team skill levels are pretty close. Um, what do you think, Mr. Commentator? I'm going to hand it off first to the commentator. Durka! Durkity Dirk Dirk! <laughs> How's it going? Hello everyone! Uh, yeah, this should be a very, very close game. Uh, both teams very solid. Haven't seen a lot of Disasterology, but I can tell you now that Equinox is very solid. And they're using Virix as a fill-in. I just noticed that now. But they are you. <laughs> oh, that's quite funny, actually. Um, but yes. Go, Mr. Main Commentator. Go, yes. Okay, well, we've got a couple going to Sniper. Faz B holding down at the nades, bus getting a nice down on Trustius and someone going down on the cog, Virix going down at Sniper bus looking to push back through on Baz B should go down, unlucky not to get the down there not a lot going on, got, a, got the Locust team pushing through the digger they will probably get sandwiched from the top and top, bottom, and middle. One member of the locust down. I believe that's Tim and Fazbe about to go down. First round goes to Disasterology. Yes, I'm a bit preoccupied on posting that live stream through. But yes, here we go. Um, nine viewers so far. God, we're quick. Anyway. First round going to Disasterology, oh, you know, Gadget being a level 8, you'd assume he's a noob, you know, because, you know, most people assume that, <laughs> getting reset early on. Um, but, what have we got here? One boom shot, two mid, one ink, that's a bit of a late start going for the Locust team picking up that ink, but, boom shot round. Oh, unlucky ink. Absolutely, there's a lot going on in that boom. On point going down. Kins are getting a nice mid shield, but getting cleaned up by Trustius, who is able to pick up the boom. Gonna have to go to work with that pretty quick. Got Virix just chilling in the middle, and Bus putting some fire down on him. Gadget holding down the sniper, who's now dropping back to to the tunnel. Big throwing some incense. And Bus just get, yes. getting cleaned up by the combination of Atlanta and Incinerary. Making the score 1 1. Trusty is going huge. <coughs> yep, yeah, still not paying attention, but Trusty is on 4 kills. Rix <laughs> on 2 down. <laughs> Solid stress. Oh, I'm, I'm, right I'm the best one out there. Um. <laughs> We've got a 2 2 from uh, Disasterology with On Point pushing on those nades pretty quickly. He's going to chuck them into the sniper, maybe clean up one member. No, they both fail. Bus getting done by. <laughs> getting cleaned up by Virix. The uh, best Team Equinox player ever. Um, he's not even in Team Equinox. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> top in the board. Oh, trust this retakes that top down in, um, getting that kill. Oh, I think two kill. I'm trying to make up crap on the spot, but I keep interrupting you, so I'm just going to shut up and let you do it. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you jumping on board with? Um, trust this. I'm going to go with him. He's top boarding. Uh, Alright. Trust it. Yes. Getting stuck on a wall. He's picking up that ink. That's probably going to go to boom. Yep, he is. Going to follow Tim down there. Ink going in from Cog. Another one going in from Trustius. Gets Kinsey. Getting full red on one one hit from on point. Some solid shotgun work there, but unfortunately cleaned up by a Tim. 
Uh, I'm proud to say that uh, trust this. You now I made trust this what he is now. You know, being a GFL previously. You know, it's just it's all me. It's all, just putting it out there. <laughs> we got. How the hell do you say the name? Fazb. Fazb. We got Faz taking on gadget. Faz B. That's how I pronounce it. Faz B. Probably okay. wrong. Faz B. Yeah, he didn't even, Gadget didn't even get to take his one-on-one, -on -one. he got boom shot in the back. They I'm actually surprised they that uh, Faz B didn't get boom, did boom shot in as well. Um, <laughs> I'm too in entertained by Faz B at the moment, so... Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna rock on. We still we're on board with gonna go with Kinsey this time. Alright. As he's heading down to the sniper throwing a smoke grenade. Should get a brief pause on Virix, you might be able to capitalize on this. Unfortunately being just shredded by that by that active Lancer. Gadget trying to get something going up the top, gets downed instantly by Tim. Yeah, well that that was a very quick first match, it's been like six minutes, but um Old Town is sometimes a quick map, uh, I guess you'd say. Um Yeah. Sorry, I was trying to see if I spelled Equinox right. <laughs> yeah, the first map goes to Team Equinox. <laughs> I, I find it funny how I have a scoreboard and I've been updating it, but I had it hidden. So, um, smart one. Lucky, lucky, you know, you can just say that, you know, the scoreboard only comes into play when someone scores around. It's a good cover. Um, I mean map. But, uh, <laughs> we're going off right now. Oh, oh mate. Mate, mate. Class act right here. Anyway, second map. What is the second... What is the second map? Um, match details. See, this is good. Post the match details in the thread. Okay, second map is Hotel. Um, what do you think the teams are going to do? I'm, I'm going to go fast. for... Uh, I'm going to go one outside, two lobby, and one talk bow, or two talk bow, one lobby, something like that. What about you? What do you reckon? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, I think uh, that... Equinox will send one straight through the middle. Try possibly try and get a, a flank on the people up at the talk bow. Yeah. Which has mm. proven to be a very strong strategy. But I'm sure that Tim will know. I'm sure they will. No idea what disasterology will do, but we'll see. Um Damn, I've got a mind blank. I, I'm, I'm, I'm in like gamer mode, I'm not in caster mode, because I have a game in like eight, at 8.30, so like in an hour <laughs> to play, I'm like, to verse you guys as well, that's right. Yeah, that's yeah, right, yeah. that's right. <laughs> Bring it, bitch. I'm going to stop the stream and just like start <laughs> like rap battling it out, man. What are you on about? <laughs> uh, yeah, Disasterology being on Locust, by Here the way, so if the scoreboard confuses you, get over it. Um, I'm lazy to change it. So, 1-0 to Equinox so far. Coming to Hotel. 2 going to Torquo for Cog Team. 1 on the Locust Team. Ooh! Bus! Bus! Trust is getting smashed there out of the Torquo. Team retreating. Like, like Tim can. That was bad. I'm not going to say that one. Uh, to answer the question in the chat, uh, Virix is playing as a fill-in. Oh! I just oh. missed that. No. We just saw a talk about I, I clicked to him straight after he got the kill. kill. Oh my god. Worst caster ever, I'm gonna go hang myself. Uh. Okay. <sighs> so, one on one. Here we have one. Bus here with the talk bow. Bus versus Timolones. Um, if I had to put it together in personal skill, I think I'd go for Timolones, but Bus has a talk bow compared to. I think it's going to shotgun. It could be useful, could not be. Depends if you're good with it. Um. Absolutely. We'll probably say a uh, first stalemate here. Um, two Red Rock Cod. Uh, no, this is not a scrim. This is an actual mosh pit match for seventh place, I think. This is also being the defending team on seventh place, Wee. Equinox being tenth. If Equinox wins this, then they'll jump up to seventh place. Um. Yeah, that, that's. Yeah. I, I was expecting <laughs> that last. I, I was. And I was waiting for that last five seconds where someone's always a smartass and just tries to charge up. But <laughs> I was waiting for that and that nothing happened. Um. Oh, yeah. Let down. I'm gonna be rocking out with 
uh, bus this time, getting three kills. <laughs> All right, we'll see what he can do on boom round. Yep. Yeah, he's heading straight out to that boom. Looks like he's going to sit on the cover there or behind the truck. We'll see. He's going to get shot by Trustius there, getting him a little red. And it looks like Tim just across the truck from him. Smoke's going in. Smoke's on bus. He's going to be paused for that brief moment. Hint in on point, getting taken out by Virix and Fazbe respectively. Fazbe going to pick up those nades. Hopefully put them oh, to use as bus goes down. Tim's going to capitalise on that. <laughs> I went to ghost cam so I could zoom out and then like it, did, like it was full starting to do 360s. Like for like 10 times <laughs> the normal sensitivity and I was like oh okay. But uh, that boom shot was like stuck under a rock so I was thinking oh maybe it's like Excalibur or something but like boom shot version but I guess not. <laughs> okay I'm going to be spectating Kill Tim Alone's here. You don't have to be spectating Tim Alone's, you just you know, just play by play I guess. He was cog. Tim's gonna cog. go up. Get a solid shot Bus on Bass. He should be down here. He's down. On point, taking Duke's out taking Faz. Out uh, no, he doesn't. Dead. No. <laughs> yeah, I, I, thought, I thought that the way he ran through that would have taken him out, but no. Nah. It's gears of war. Kid, gears yeah. of war. If you're on the cover, you win. <laughs> two nil, two team Equinox. Um, they seem to be playing very strongly here. Um, I, my vote was actually for Disasterology coming to this. Uh, I would have thought Gadget being a level 8 to uh, turn the tables. Yep. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Virix going, going big on, on point. Fast way taking out Kinsey again. Virix putting those nades to work on bus. <laughs> And Gadget is going to get flanked by Fazbe. He's going to try and get something going, but it's just Gadget, not going to happen. Gadget, you stayed on the cover. Oh, oh he's a Grim Bar. Gears of War, stay on the cover, you win. Prove to me that you Unless you have a boom shot, then you run. Like crazy. <laughs> yeah. Probably up shit yeah. then, but... <laughs> <laughs> That's the only exception to the rule. But, um, what's good? <laughs> we have Virix topping the board 7-1 to one for Equinox, even though he's in Legacy. Bus going 3-3. Three to three. I think he's going to pick up those incense, going to try and kill Virix off. Misses. It's not going to happen, but we've got uh, Trustius up the top just charging that torque. Fazbe putting some shotty shots down. That's horrible that is. He's going to push on point. Should be able to get him. Yep, Trustius takes out Gadget as well. Puts this into a 3v1. Kinsey going big. Takes out Trustius with ease. Tim. All class act Yeah, well, that's down. the second uh, map done in a 4 0. Um, quite convincingly, 4 1, 4 0. That's quite convincingly. I know they're using Virix, but that's not really anything to judge. Virix has been going good, but it's only because of the setups the teams have been giving him, so you can't just give him all that credit. Um, yeah, absolutely. But Equinox seems to just be dominating, and, you know, nice restrictive Nat. Um, changing hosts, I believe, or are we using the same one? Not exactly sure. I guess we're using the same one. I have no um, idea. I don't think they really care. Uh, next map is King of the Hill on the slab. That's actually a pretty good map. I haven't seen that one streamed yet. Good to, considering I'm the streamer. But, uh... <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. pretty big. Um, it's just been added no. to the cycle. No, uh... Midnight and his cloud. Yeah, slab Midnight plays really cloud. well. Finally decided to add it. Um... <laughs> <laughs> About time. Yeah. Just put it um, out there. No, nah, but uh, the slab plays really well for both Execution and King of the Hill when the, the weapon swaps are in place, yep. obviously. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's it, it's going to be interesting over the next couple of weeks to see how uh, teams yeah, adapt. One, to one person the new just laid down now, but uh, just, just for out. the viewers' information, it is the weapon swaps are the only weapon swaps f this map out of the whole Gears cycle. Um, they basically do it so that it's round two. And um, so you have a digger instead of a boom shot, inks instead of smokes, and incendiaries instead of frags. Um, it is a good change, I reckon. I don't know. I think having a boom shot and frag grenades will be a bit overpowered for a map, um, for a king of the hill map, anyway. Yep. yep Considering absolutely. it's only got like what two, five spawns. <laughs> Like five ring spawns. <laughs> <laughs> yep, and we 
We do have a host change here, I believe. Have you got an um, I haven't actually checked. My notifications are off. I'm just waiting to for the lobby to end so that um, you know, I don't have that retarded party lobby creating thingy that gets stuck and makes me unable to do anything. Yeah, mate. Yeah, Ooh, okay. Dirk are sending me an invite. I think I should feel special. <laughs> 25,771 gamer score. Only about 21,000 of that glitch. Oh, Sorry, really? what? <laughs> <laughs> My glitches are so good, they just, you know, don't work. Um, yeah. Yeah, nice. Yeah, solid, solid effort. effort. This game going. King of the Hill, are we? No idea who just lagged out. Looks like Vera. Sixty-four thousand one hundred ninety game score. That's a nice effort, big killer. Um. I think someone in the Gears community has 200,000 gamer score. And uh, like me recently, he just got reset. Then he got it back. But it was good. That would have given me a heart attack if I uh, yeah, cared about achievements. But uh, I had 40 something thousand gamer score and then it got reset the other day. And I had to like wait for them to fix it so I can read down my profile. And it sucked because I lost like three achievements while like, my gamer score was reset that I earned. Now they're locked again. I can't be bothered to like, you know, replay the whole thing. <laughs> Oh, bus is back. Okay, let's get this started. Yeah, I... This is King of the Hill Slab, uh, isn't it? Yeah, King of the Hill Slab. Right. So basically, with the with the slab, the main thing that teams are looking to do is hold down those nades. To begin with, as the first first hill is on the nades always, and then uh, from then try and transition into the next hill, which is usually in the uh, in the digger, but can be other way. Um, but while trying to maintain that uh, that top control up at the nades, from there they can uh, usually try and lock down the spawns, control them, and yeah. Be very yeah, interesting. I, I'm a big fan of Slab. I think it's better than um, some of the other maps you can put on for King of the Hill, like Hotel. Imagine Hotel King of the Hill, you keep spawning in the elevator and you'll just be like having to run like 30 seconds to get to a ring and then it'll already be over and then you have to run to the next one. And <sighs> I didn't even hear what you said but uh, earlier on, but uh, apparently, um, you know, it's always Pistol Durka. You so silly. Uh, uh, I, I wasn't uh. even listening to what the comment was but okay well what'd you say i was just i like zoned out of you uh the second, the second hill was pistol the second hill if, yeah it's always pistol. pistol getting called out by quad there why what did you say i said it's either the pistol or oh, no. the digger digger amateur digger. amateur mistake digger's absolutely last. digger's always last <laughs> it's it is it the only one that it's random is the smoke grenades. It could either be at one of the other smoke grenades, but it's always incense, pistol, smoke grenade, smoke grenade, and then digger, and then it redoes it again. Oh, okay. But ah, uh, God, you should you should know this. You're in a team. You you, you guys are eleventh, <laughs> I think. That, that's a guess. <gasps> Am I right? Yes, you guys are eleventh. Yeah, yeah buddy. I think so. Um, you guys are eleventh. You should know this. Okay. You're a top team. You're versing us, who are, who, where are we? We're fifth. Ooh, we're fifth. Yeah. It's gonna be a big game. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna Start be going now. with Faz B, because I love the name. We've got... We've got three from Disasterology that are gonna go straight for that hill. Uh, looks like Tim's gonna try and push through and grab the ink for Equinox. He's probably gonna use that to try and keep them off the hill to begin with. Just getting some solid lands of fire up there at the moment. Uh, looks like Bus trying to go for a cat. Same with On Point. They should be able to get this. Yep, they've got the got the first cat, which is always good. Unfortunately, On Point going down. But Tim alone's with a with a nice ink on Kinsey, putting him down and out. 
and Templar sending up a very nice digger to take out Gadget. As Bus gets a 15 second respawn, which is unfortunate. On point trying to make his way through the digger, but probably going to be hard to get through there. Gadget going wide through the smoke grenades. On point trying to get something going in <laughs> the digger. He's got a 2v1, but he now has Bus's support who luckily spawned down there. Kinsey <laughs> chainsawing Tim alone. It's a big play, and Trusty is taking Trusty him is, out. I taught you better. Wait, you never oh. use nades anymore. Don't worry, <laughs> scratch that. Down in front. <laughs> Trusty is taking out Gadget. Did he get his Yeah, he gets down. He's... Oh, but yeah, he, he'll be down. able to pick himself back up. That was up. probably the wrong thing to do there. He, he probably should have taken that meat shield, and he would have been able to secure that cap. But never mind. Gets taken out by on point, just as he's about to get up. Him heading in there, getting he's going to get crossed by on point. Yep, straight down. As the next hill does indeed go to the pistol. Ooh, big surprise right there. <laughs> and in going in there, just probably going to hold him up from uh, capturing that as easy. Yep, capturing it as easy. That's why they've got two people in there capturing it. Um, <laughs> three people going on gadget side, I believe. Gadget just runs straight past two of them. <laughs> <laughs> God takes help, Timberlones. Oh, I thought he took out Buster. Can get to do it? Can you get three men? Get two. Get two. Trusty is oh, taking the out no. B. He's own teammate. Gadget. He's gonna have to get him up. Gadget. Gadget. There gadget, we gadget, go. gadget. I was going for Gadget to use his go-go gadget powers, pull out the hammer from his head, and just start bashing people. <laughs> Smoke's going in there everywhere. His gadget gets cleaned up by a nice, by a nice bit of work by Faz B. As he goes down, we'll get revived by Tim alone. There's three, three members in there. Tim getting smashed by on, on point, point, who also goes on to kill Faz B. Can he do it? Can he get the oh, triple? Kinsey comes in to back him up. He will, and ah, oh, Kinsey <laughs> gets that capped. He should feel robbed. <laughs> on the left, on point. I think. No, I was wrong. Never mind. <laughs> Alone, he's trying to go for a mantle kick, just not going to happen as Bus backs away. Templar going down as well, there's no way he's getting in there. <laughs> but uh, Disasterologist having a complete uh, setup of this hill so far, already pushing over to the next one. Um, good move. Have all kids yep, on point gets absolutely. inked, gets taken out. I, I'm, look, I'm just going to take Faz, I'm not going to even worry about the feet. Gadget's going to go down, as far as he goes, goes down in the cap. Trust this with the meat shield, about to smoke out. Oh, gets taken out by Onpoint. Bus taking on Tim alone. Point. He's forcing him getting taken out, even though his teammates are up there to help him. Oh, but he had to reload, not the best move. It's still alive, how is he still alive? Zerka, fine. <laughs> It's beyond me, mate. It's beyond me. Tim alone is just going to work with that meat shield. Taking down Bus. Sorry, making it look Ekinox easy. He's going to try and go Gadget to work on Gadget. Taken Gadget. Out, Superman style. Templar versing Baird. I don't know who Baird is. On point. Okay, there we go. Interestingly, uh, Equinox hasn't blocked the close spawn. So. Uh, Disasterology will be able to spawn there and probably capitalise on this as they've got a 2v1 on Trustius, they take him out, gonna get a cap. As Templar and Tim Lones come back for the, for the cap, Tim's gonna take a nice mech shield on Gadget. Probably gonna get the last 25 seconds. Yeah, 25 of this seconds is a big thing, that'll bring him up to 100. Um, that's a nice lead to have, 40 points lead. So, well, Tim Lone takes out Kimsey. Tim Lone just taking the Lancer bullet, saying, I don't care, I just want to kill you. Gadget getting taken out, being <laughs> Sam. Poor Sam. Tim Lone's diving into that digger. Crucial mistake. As Templar and Bass seem to have downed each other. Old fashioned bleed out. But Kimsey's going to come along, clean up Templar. Not going to bother with reviving Bass. 
as the hill move is about to move on to the other uh, ink grenade. Durka finally knowing he spawns. <laughs> the game had to tell me, man. Yeah, the game I'm had sure. to tell me. <laughs> oh, on point. Just wall bound. Gadget versing someone. Uh, Trust this is being taken out. Hopefully, a quick cap by Disasterology can get him that catch stop that they need. 30 points. <laughs> nice trade there. Stop oh, choking on air here. Yep, absolutely. Oh. Okay. Bus taking out Tim. And it seems that they, they still haven't blocked this back spawn. Neither team has done that yet. And it's really big for, for this hill. Very surprising. Trusty is getting a, getting the break. That's the main thing. That was his mission. But uh, it's going to be quickly recovered by Bus and Kinsey coming in for the free 300 or 350 points. Tim going in there, going big, picking up another meat shield. Being lancing in the back by point, but getting taken out. Trust this gear's been the last one left. Kinsey, premature whack. That's what she said. But, uh, trust this. Trust this should be full red by now. Yep, it's full red. Waiting for Tim alone. Shit, yeah. Two on two, okay. Gadget just, you know, chucking that friendly fire, um, with fire. But okay. Ooh, Gadget taking out Trustius. I'm not even sure what's going on. Tim now. is in that hill trying to. Oh, Tim and Gadget down themselves, but Tim quickly gets a call out to Templar, who's sitting in the digger and can clean up that kill. Basically, and Templar are both sitting in that digger as they will get the. Uh, that next hill, they've set up well for that. With two members of Disasterology up at the nades, bus going down. Now Trustis is up there, got that pop control, which is huge Jim for this just hill. going off, taking out Kinsey, even though Kinsey has the first shot advantage. Jim Lones is going huge with nearly 4,000 points already. Yeah, lead 15 by kills. points at the right. At least, sorry, not sorry. Oh. Crazy effort. Just, just smashing Especially on points Especially since there. there's still like another 100 points left in this game, at least. Kinsey Kung for the yeah, chainsaw, absolutely. but missing. Trading with buffs. Horribly. Trusty is taking him out. Gadget on point. Going for that hill from ink side. Um, trying to land so I don't even know what they're doing. Chucking smokes out. Through a window that bounces back. They, they seem to be just all over the place. Yep, absolutely. Really good setup here by Equinox. They're really holding it down well. They've got the two in the middle, which can pretty much support anywhere on the map. I reckon just. But uh, just we're going to try and we're going to see Bus and Gadget try and push through the. Uh, I, I don't Sorry, think they should on. even bother with this one. It's, it's gone straight for the uh, the incense, like uh, like you were told earlier. It had 10 seconds left and they were still trying to contest the uh, the hill that had only an ink in the way. There was not even anyone there, there was one person there. And they took the bait, I guess. But they yeah, still managed absolutely. to get this next hill, which confuses me. Oh no, they don't. Mm -hmm. On point, gonna try and get something going here. He takes out Templar, very well done with three people on him. Gadget, Gadget goes large. Smashing Tim and Trust. Still one left though, he still needs to take out. Gets He's probably going to get taken oh, by a if phase he didn't roll, then he oh. could have got that. Yep. Three people absolutely. now on the hill, or going for the hill. Um, Templar behind. Oh, Disasterology. Oh, getting taken out by Buff. On point taking out Faz. I really got to ask the guy how he got that, that name, but uh, Buff's not showing, not sure what to do right now. <laughs> and they get the cap, but it will probably be broken pretty quickly. No, it won't. <laughs> wrong, wrong team. Yeah. Wrong, wrong team, man. Yeah. Um, should be watching the stream for the scoreboard to tell you which team to watch. <laughs> but yeah, Disasterology seems to be going for the cap and just getting lucky by getting this uh, slang in return, but uh, Timolo just rushing in there to break it, but I don't, I'm not sure if that was the best idea. At least he got Absolutely. the spawn wave. Gadget gonna go in he for that cap. He missed the spawn wave and had to wait 15 seconds. He would have been spewing. Oh, absolutely. 
Gadget's going to try and push up on Faz B here as he is all by himself. Very well done there to not take out his teammate. But Equinox has two members in the in the hill. They're going to get that cap easy. Gadget's going to go go through straight through Templar, but get taken out by Trustius who meat shields him. If Equinox is any smart, they'd be going straight for that pistol. Um, Ten seconds left. It's not. It's not worth it. Disasterology spawns uh, on that pistol. Disasterology has they set up. Yeah, they've spawned up there. Ten seconds to go. Whether it's capped or not capped, you set up for the next kill. I reckon that's 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 the most smartest solution because ten points at the end of the day, unless it's going to take give you the win, there's no point. Um, it's better to get a set up. Absolutely. Fazb doing some good work on on point there, but Kinsey going to push through the through the digger, try and get something going. He gets taken down. Atrastius is going to shield him. They have this. They have this They've last really play. Solid lock These here. two members going down to the pistol have this last play to do anything. Otherwise, I think it's game. Yep, absolutely. Smoke grenades going in. Bus getting a nice man or kick. Jump, can... Will that delay yes, him from getting there? No, they will get the break on the very last point. Bus and. Trusty is trade and Fazbe takes out Gadget. Nah, game. That's game. Templar sitting up the top at the grenades, but that's it. That's uh, that's that's game over. Three 0 to Team Equinox. They um, they just went all out. I just noticed actually this this map that Virx wasn't playing for them. It's, I picked up straight away, you know. Um, but yeah, that's that's the end of this game. Um, Unlucky disasterology. Team Equinox does take that seventh place, I guess. What do you think of the the match there, Durka? Oh, Equinox was just a class act. There was really not a lot you could uh, fail them on. Uh, a couple things here and there, but as a team, I reckon they worked well as as a core. Uh, you could see that their communication was solid. But when it came down to it, uh, disasterology. Got outplayed. Simple as that. Solid game, but yeah, definitely a solid game. I, like I said earlier, I was going for Disasterology to win, mostly because I thought their teamwork would uh, prevail them. But Equinox is definitely a team to look out for. They're definitely going strong, taking that seventh spot now. Um, for those who don't know, this uh, ladder lock will be on the 23rd of March. So teams try to get up there in that top eight to go for the CG. Uh, season 1 finals for Gears of War. Um, I'm sure you already knew that, Durka. That's why you challenged us, being the only free team at the time. <laughs> <laughs> Never. <laughs> um, but yeah, t remember to tune in to um, our stream later on tonight. 9pm Australian Eastern DT, whatever the D stands for. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, B Team BBR vs Team Legacy. No, Team BBR vs Legacy. Uh, definitely a good match. I reckon it'll be the best one of the night so far. Um, I think that'll be the last match of the night. Maybe, depending if I might be streaming a Malice Reborn game after that. Um, remember to follow me on Twitter if you use Twitter. You know, my 94 Remember to follow this guy, Xderka. The same as his gamertag. <laughs> um, so look at his gamertag. Follow him on Twitter. Um, but yeah, remember to follow the channel as well. And remember to tune in at night. Now and 15 minutes away. Yep. Goodbye all. Too easy. Alright.